Grooming. Today we are doing a bath for an English Bulldog. Um, Emily wants to bathe it so I'm going to record her bathing it and walk you through the whole process. She's so freaking cute though and her dad takes such good care of her. She doesn't have face stains or anything. She says hi. That's Emily. Here. Hi. Say hi Emily. We'll break her in. It's fine. <laughs> All right. I hope you guys enjoy. This so, is Lola, Lola Ann. Yeah, I'm the D shot and then the medical, medicated. Yes, so she's got sensitive skin, so we're gonna give her a D shed. And actually, is there any more of the hemp D shed left? Yeah. That's the one I think that we use normally. This one's the shampoo. They're both shampoo. You'll, you'll use regular D shed conditioner. You want the deodorizing because she's a little Okay. So we'll bathe her once with the deodorizing and then once with the D shed and then do her conditioner treatment. Emily has said that sh she thinks she's a better bather than me, so we're about to find out. I've never said that, <laughs> I've never said that one time. She's never said it, but she's implied it. <laughs> Look at her face. She's like, what? I've never said that. I said I was a better bather than our last one there. Yeah. Okay, okay. We love everyone. Yeah. Lola's so cute. I just wanted to see Look at that face. Look at that pretty face. There we go. Whoop! Sorry, you're going to get crazy. Wipey, wipey! <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're good. I've never had anyone record me well. Yeah, well, so this is the kind of videos I'm going to be doing. I'm going to do some videos where I record and it's on my head and I'm doing it, but I want to get back into teaching. So a lot of my videos are going to be me walking other people through what they're doing. Um, I've noticed I explain pretty well when I'm the one grooming it, but I do even better when I have someone I'm teaching. Like, I remember what I want to say better. So... Lola, 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 we got Rubba Dub Dub, Miss Lola Ann is in the tub. <laughs> so right now she's just getting her all wet. Alright, soap can get into the coat. Right here. Yeah, applying soap, it's kind of like her own hair. You don't just put shampoo in dry hair. You got to get it wet first. I'm sorry. I know. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. And we're going to show you how we clean those folds as well. Her face fat. All right. So let me see that. Oh, it's you. So I haven't showed you guys my hemp products. Um, I can't order them online. I have to go who pet smart to buy them uh i don't know why hemp's is like that but i really really like these for any kind of dog that has sensitive skin or um whatever and they have so many options uh this brand has a lot of options there's the herbalizing deodorizing which is hydration and then whoop, the second one we're going to use is a d shed um it doesn't work as well as my d shed However, sometimes their skin, actually most of the time, all of the time, their skin is more important than how much hair we can keep off. If he's going, if she, if she goes home itching and uncomfortable, then what's the point in getting, yeah, yeah, you get what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah. all good in the hood bro tato so she you saw i didn't even have to tell her to scrub them no no squares <laughs> always 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 scrub the no no squares especially in front because it nice. they can get bacteria and infections and yucky 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 okay you guys i really like how she bathes these dogs this is the first time i've seen her bathe the dog <laughs> it's weird not having to teach someone too she already knows. <laughs> so, <laughs> Miss. 
Get in there. Don't drop that. that <laughs> nope. Oh, oh, are you okay? <clears throat> she fell in that little hole. <laughs> the little hole. Oh, that's not good. This smells so good. Is it the aloe stuff? No, it's the hemp. The, my hemp stuff. Oh. It's the deodorant. I can't smell nothing. She's stinky. smell a vision uh, I'm tall. This is going to have to come up a little. Are you woke? Are you woke? Ah, here we go. Uh, much better. Much better. I guess I could go up here and get out of her butt. Why? You don't like the butt? I don't like, I like the butt. She got a cute butt. Look at that face. <gasps> she touched the butt. <laughs> Wait, I missed it. Do it again. Touchy, touchy. Okay, let's stop. <laughs> People are like, why are you picking on this dog? We're not picking on Lola. We love Lola. Lola is actually super duper cute. One of our favorites. Look how well she is bathing this like, dog. I hate you all for bathing me. I got this like already, but I feel like I didn't get it good enough. Okay. All right, whoosh. Ooh, shake it, shake it. Lola, she's so pretty. I gotta get a picture. Okay, I'm gonna pause. She's doing such a great job on that bit. Make sure you explain the flappies. So you get in between them. You gotta get your finger in there. You go, you go, cub. Cause they will get super yeasty and really bad, and it can cause a huge infection in the face. A lot of bulldog owners have to wipe actually this area a lot to reduce infection and bacteria growth. Oh, information. Yeah, information highway. How do you like the info? <laughs> so guys, my goal with all of this is to teach people how to do things, but I can't teach people if I'm not willing to take people who are better than me. I'm about to say this on YouTube. Do not, uh, it's okay. <laughs> Emily has a little more experience than me, and she's actually had a lot more uh, continued education training. I like it. Uh, so, so I, like it. Going to I do too. Uh, we're doing our first seminar. Are you still going with me? Yeah. So we're doing a uh, seminar at the end of February, and I'll be putting that on my YouTube. The the guy who's running it. What uh, what is his name? Uh, it's like Brian. No, it's. Oh. J Jeremy, 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 Jeremy. I thought his last name. I thought his name was Brandon Johnson. No, it's a. It starts with a J. I think. I'm also here with me. So. Right, safe. It's fine. Anyway, uh, Jim, my Jim dude, my scissors, my amazing scissors, got me hooked up for this class. He's gonna be doing a uh, tutorial on proper clean blade cleaning and and uh, different things. So we got invited and I get to record some of his training class. So I'm super excited. I've had CPR training um, and first aid training, but this will be my, my first grooming continuing education class because everything I've learned is self-taught or I've watched other groomers. So just like you guys are watching me and I forgot his butt all in the picture. <laughs> Sorry, her butt. He likes the butt apparently. I do. They're so cute. They got a little chunky butt. They do got chunky butts. And when they walk around, they see the little butt. Their wrinkly faces and their chunky butts are what makes them so toot. <laughs> Don't forget the glands. He wanted the glands, please. Yeah, I was gonna do that last thing, but you said Okay, so that's the difference between her and me. Is I always do my glands uh, before I start shampooing, or after I get some of the first shampoo on, so that way it doesn't. I don't want to stick in this type of hair. Yeah, I don't. Uh, but it doesn't smell as bad when you're already washing it twice. Yeah. I'm giving them like four baths, so four. Yeah, because she also gets to the skin. That's what he asked for. Oh yeah, you're right, you're right. See, I, I even got to tell her. She just does it. <laughs> this is cool. I want to do the deodorant because she's just kind of stinky. Her stinky. That's just kind of like a thing with bulldogs too. They just give off a stink. They can't help it. Come here, baby. 
Come here, you come this way. I'm gonna just manhandle you this way. Come on, babies. She's such a know it all. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I love purebreds. I'm totally just and kidding. I'm, I'm giving you a hard time. <laughs> and I just came over here to get away from her butt. You put her butt back in my face. Well, I'm sorry. I had to wash that side of the butt. That's fine. That's fine. I can't have this one side all real clean. All right. So I'm going to. Oh, I'm going to let her rinse this, this baby and uh, see if I can get. If I can offer them one free groom a week. And that'll be my full grooms every week is a free shelter dog. Oh, that would be really, I, I want to do that. that would be great. It's my way of giving back. Yeah. Well, and I mean, if they have, have more, yeah, if, if they have more, I don't mind doing more. I, I just want to offer a couple yeah. of free grooms. Yeah, and that'll also like amp up their chances of getting adopted. adopted yeah. Yeah. I might actually go do that this afternoon, but I still have Hippie's video I gotta do too. And I gotta finish Ziva's video. Ziva, oh my gosh. She's so sweet. Yeah, she's fine. Mm -hmm. She sat the other day for a while. It'll Her hair soaks in better if you let her sit longer. She's just got coarse hair, I guess. I don't know. She's like, stop, I'm done back there. No, touch my no-no square. <laughs> She's like, you really got it in, okay? It's good. It's good now. <laughs> it would have been on that chest area. <sighs> Her head too close to the ball. Okay, there we go. Okay. Morning. Hello. Morning. Let's see how I can get it. She's not doing nothing. Is that Molly? Did you see her? I don't know. It's Molly. Molly is okay. a, a rescue. She used to eat me alive when she would come in. Like we had to have a some love sessions and a lots of hearts to hearts. And then now she'll she'll let people groom her now. Now she doesn't care who grooms her. No. But it took a lot of patience and a lot of love. So you can I got that. I can do that. So like as soon as I see her. All right. Well, look at that. Look at all that hair. Look at all that. Now I cleaned out this drain right prior to washing, so. It should be good. It should be good. The blood, the, the, the defect. Going. The shirt conditioner it takes so much longer to get out, but it does benefit a lot to the dog. Some groomers say don't wash it all out, but I'm one of the ones that I have to wash it all out. For what? Um, so some groomers leave it in because whenever they're like a little bit in, not like a whole lot. Are we talking about shampoo or conditioner? The conditioner. Okay, I do leave some of it in. I don't because I worry about it causing any kind of reaction or buildup onto the skin. And that's just, that's an, my own personal thing. But other groomers leave it in because it leaves for more hair to come out during the drying process. But that's just, like I said, personal. Okay. One more bath. Alright, so we are on bath number four. four. We are on bath number four. I'm exhausted. I don't want it anymore. <laughs> Um, um, I, I do four baths when they're super dirty, but usually it's two or three. So this is, <laughs> yeah, the first one I was like, bulldogs are really stinky. They are. So not too bad, though. I don't know what it, it ma makes about their skin. He's really good about bringing her in. I'm telling you, he takes he does. great no, care of her. She, he, like, loves her. She, she does not have any stains on her face. Like most of them do. Are you using the Greek yogurt or? The Greek yogurt smells really good and it's really good for their skin. Too. I do like the Greek yogurt yeah. right here too. That's what I mean. Yep, we like Greek but yogurt. Will you pull that? Let them see the oh yeah the bottle. It's the yogurt with the pomegranates, you know. The pomegranate from, from the Greeks. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be a great addition to my YouTube. We're good. We're good. I see. I'm trying to double record right now. 
Uh, and, yeah, shut the door. I got you. I'm watching. Oh, it smells so good. I told you that one is like a maze it ball. Smells, it smells like you're about to eat some pomegranate yogurt. <laughs> like it smells so good. She's scrubbing that dough. Look at the look at the wabber. Scrub, scrub, scrub. The, scrub, my scrub. niece has a theory on her bathing. She's a great bather, like best bather I've ever seen in my life. And uh, she's a theory that the suds is what really. Hey, really you know what's funny? If you watch sudsy. my videos, I say that too. Yeah, that's crazy. I don't stop scrubbing until it suds up, and it's like almost this. like a thick foam in my hand. Wait, that's great. See, I don't so. have to show her nothing. <laughs> this is great. I also took a bathing class, so <laughs> it's so it's so different. Achieved. Like going from students to an experienced groomer, it's really cool. It's it's a nice. Uh, a nice little break so I can focus on YouTube. My screen's turning yellow again. What the? Oh, it's the shade. Okay, cool. Yeah. Let's kind of jump up over this way. Good job. Look at that cute face. It's like the cutest. My hands are like numb now. <laughs> how well she scrubbed on those pads. Real nice. Oh, we'll quit before I get another video. Oh, hell. I'll do it on that side. Oops. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, you can do that. It's really hard trying to do two videos <laughs> at once. Because you like the angles. <laughs> <laughs> All right. She is just about done. All right. She's going to rinse her, and then we're going to dry her. Two sweet babies. The girl the pink off my head. And then I'm going to show you how to do her toenails. Well, Emily's going to do her toenails, and we'll talk going. about it. Like the only part that stayed was my fingernails. Sorry, we dyed my dog with a heart and some purple for Valentine's Day. Well, she was that I dyed a whole dog. <laughs> oh, yeah. And yesterday she dyed a mohawk and a tail pink for Valentine's Day. And I just went ham with it. I was like scrubbing it like I do with my suit. A sheep. A sheep. Huh? I, I was making fun of how you said soap. Sheep. I was not even recording on the bottom one. Dummy. Hi, my baby. Hi, baby. No, you gotta stay. You gotta stay. Sugar, sugar. Is that how the job acts? Don't dry the folds. Don't dry the folds. Bacteria a little bit. Just from the humidity. <laughs> Hello, beautiful. Okay, come back. Sorry, I'm trying to get a good angle. And then I dry the neck like this because I think it looks cool. <laughs> oh, you just are pretty baby. Look at that face. How you say I don't like that face? All right. Safety first. Safety. Safety so good. Oh, look, she put her paw out. Yeah. Was that not the I mean, like, put your paw back out so I can get it for Tiki Talkie.
So we don't fry anything from here. Yeah, oh. I wasn't going to. Okay. That was like hurt. Yeah. <laughs> you got mad. I thought it was going to be like that. Yeah. Yeah. Show her the, the brush, see how much hair is on there. The cube. Like barely enough. Not much. Didn't take hardly anything off. That means her got good t-shirt. Her did. Emily did a good job. Yeah. Oh, it's just so cute. Why are you so cute? She's so cute. <laughs> she says hi that's what i've been trying to get her to do this whole time finally we got it you're gonna get your nails did thank you all right over here you gonna give it to me give me one which one okay hold on let me get close sorry Oh, it's okay. I know. Daddy likes some shorts, though. Okay, guys. Put your foot up there, sister. You're all right, sissy. So what she's doing, she's starting at the top and working her way down. You want to get as close to that quick as you can and she's feeling for any sharp edges if you can't see the quick you can also feel it I know that sounds weird it's kind of got like a a soft squishy feeling um, and she's just going slow and steady when you get more experienced at it then you can pretty much guess where they're at without hurting them but when you're newer I definitely suggest taking your time That's exactly what I didn't want happening. What, your hair? Yeah. <laughs> so, you see, she just keeps feeling, and she's a newer groomer, so she definitely takes her time, which is totally fine. You should always take your time until you're comfortable. Don't do anything. Ah, 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 don't get your... Oh, she got her finger. <laughs> yeah, don't do that. That hurts. Uh, don't do anything you're not comfortable with. Don't rush yourself because someone else next to you is rushing because they might have more experience than you and uh, might know where to go. Look at that feet porn. Oh, I got my knuckles really good. That Toenail so porn good. winning. All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. There's Emily in the background. She's about to grim another dog. Um, but I wanted to do that. So that you guys could understand that sometimes it's okay to have, actually all the time, it is okay to have another groomer that's better than you. It's, you should have people that are better than you. You don't learn, you don't grow, you don't experience, you don't open up your mind to different options and things if you don't have people that are better than you around you in your life. So um, I hope you enjoyed the way she bathed that dog, Miss Lola, Lola Rose. Lola Ann. The other one was Rose. My bad. Lola Ann. Uh, if you like this video, don't forget to push the little like button, subscribe if you'd like, and push that bell icon so you can get notifications for all my videos. Anyways, alright, hope you guys enjoyed. Bye! The <laughs> whole point is to... Hold on, what? Are you nervous? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh -hoo -hoo. You want to get wet? Wipey, wipey! Go ahead, Tara. I see you in the background doing something stupid. I'm putting my phone in my pocket. Damn. I'm waiting for you to do something stupid. Hi, Tara. <laughs> Let me just move over here because that was gross. <laughs> Start over.